Hello stampers. What I have to show you today is my scrapbooking. Now this is off the page scrapbooking and I've been pretty busy hence the reason why my posts might not have been updated as recently as they should have been. But I just wanted to show you this. I'm making it for my sister's wedding. I purchased this box from Spotlight and I have painted it with the Tim Holtz Distressing Picket Fence paint and you can see the distressing crackle that's happening around the outside of the box. I then put a bit of the smash tape around the edge so that's just the, the washi tape and at the bottom I bought a punched out of vellum and I added a Kayser Craft pearl around the edge like so. Now for the top I have used the Tim Holtz tattered pine cone die and instead of rolling it tightly to make the pine cone what I have done is unraveled it a little bit to give that beautiful little rose shape and these are the the branches that go with that. To have them sort of sticking up high there on the top to do that I made a roll of the same coloured pattern paper and then I started by layering the flowers over the top and then adding them in so there is symmetry to the top pattern just to make sure that I've got it all there and I've attached a whispering white Stampin' Up! ribbon to the front so this is what it looks like so far and this can all be clipped shut now the idea for this box is as a guest book and it's a guest book with a difference so inside what I'm beginning to make are these little cards and there'll be a set of a few, or there'll be a few of these depending on how many guests there are so all I did was cut the white, cock, white card stock to size and I ran it through the embossing folder just to get the edge and then I have used a stamp from Stamping Up called Congrats and this one comes from the set Tagtastic so it's the bottom one there from that set of stamps and I've stamped that onto each one and then using the same pattern paper that I made the roses out of in the front I've just made a little holder for those so that they can be grouped in. So I need to continue making some of these to put on the inside and also go and look for a nice pretty pen that can be put in the box with them and this will be laid out for the guests at my sister's wedding to be able to write their special message to her and a good keepsake for her to have on the shelf afterwards. So that is what I am scrapbooking this week. Thanks for watching.